Um, hello, everyone. Um, I'm James Rowe, and uh, this here is my brother, Parker. And, uh, yeah, we're just here to, I don't know, talk about whatever. Oh, come on, James, tell them the real reason why you're talking. All right, all right, all right. Okay, listen, guys. Um, this, uh, brand new series, pretty much, pretty much me, my brother, Parker, and my twin brother, Aston, pretty much just doing a vlog about all the dra the modified drivers' lives. You know, see what they do behind the scenes. Before and after races. Though we got nothing after the Walt Disney World Speedway. Anyway, so basically we'll be doing some interviews and stuff here and there. Have hidden cameras around for, you know, see what the modified drivers are like when they're not on the track or getting ready for a race or whatever. Oh, and one more thing. Uh, uh, as we're recording all this, we're pretty much preparing, pretty much shows footage for, of drivers preparing for the Toronto One Mile, or aka the Rimmel Compound, our very backyard. And though uh, most drivers have struggled to make it north of the border, and by most I mean Riddick Dow, pretty much everyone enjoyed the fun joyride. You mean journey? Well, I call it a joyride. Oh, uh, Robbie? What are you doing here? here? Just what are you guys doing behind this wall? It doesn't seem kind of suspicious. Are you recording something? Oh, come on, Robbie. You know us. We're just chilling. Yeah, come on, Robbie. Like, you know, just... Alright, fine. I'll let you off the hook for now, but if I catch you doing anything suspicious... He never really told us what he was going to do. Ah, whatever. Like, he really stop us. Well, anyway, guys, uh, onwards with the footage. Roll it. Beep, boop, beep, beep. Man, I still can't believe that you and your two brothers are in the top ten of points right now. Well, Doug, it's not exactly something I've been paying attention to. I mean, it's only a second race of the season. Oh, whatever. At least things are going great for you. Oh, hey, Doug, do you know how much time is left before the race? Well, the driver's meeting for the debut in cars is still going on. It, or hasn't started yet, actually, as far as I know. I also don't get it. Why is there a separate meeting for debut in cars anyway? I mean, it all seems kind of pointless if you ask me. Uh, thing is, Doug, I heard it's because that there's way too many cars attempting to qualify for this race. More than this track could take. Although, my brother kept me out of the loop for some reason. <laughs> hey, Sorensen! Um, I'm Aston Rimmel. I mean, whatever! Where are your brothers? I don't know. Probably doing the driver's meeting for his debut in cars right now. Why? Well, I have a feeling that they're up to no good. Okay, but what makes you say that, brother? Well, for starters, the fans seem to be going nuts about those guys. I mean, we're literally in the backyard of the Rimmel household. Shouldn't be a shocker. Oh, whatever. Just tell me if you find those guys. Got it? All right. Okay, that was bizarre. Now, what up, Trackmaster viewers? This is Matt Kazarian, hailing from Green Bay, Wisconsin. Not sure if I was supposed to say that, but anyway, the point is, you guys are watching the modified vlogs. Hello everyone, it is I myself Trackmaster uh, for, and I'm here with a very important announcement about tonight's race. This means for all you drivers who have who are just starting the season in this very race or have finished poorly before. So basically the rule is if you get lapped within the first three laps of a start or the restart, you will be automatically be parked by the officials. Well, wait, well wait, that's oh, pretty man, bizarre. You gotta be kidding me. Like, wait a minute, but why? That doesn't really make any sense. Because in the last race, it was discovered that it was because of lap cars going way too slow compared to the other drivers 
that the accidents happen. BJ McLeod and Timmy Catalino are prime examples of that. Well, wait a minute. What did I hear? I didn't do anything. I just said earlier this meeting was for all drivers debuting and drivers who have failed to qualify in the recent re. What? You know what I mean? Okay. Now I'll be taking any questions if you guys have any. Okay. Now I know this race isn't a road course, but I have to know. And do you know how many road courses there will be this season? Well, still not sure yet, but there should be at least three for this season. Ha <laughs> ha, yes! So how many cars maximum are they allowing into the race? Well, only about 30 or so cars are, will be allowed to be in this race. What the? Why? That doesn't seem fit. fit. They're only allowing about 30, and that's that, Alex. Quit your whining. Well, that about wraps up this meeting. Y'all stay safe out there. Well, unfortunately, the rest of the footage was lost as uh, Robbie unfortunately found one of our cameras and destroyed it. Yeah, he's uh, pretty brutal that way. Well, anyways, guys, that will be all for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. As this is me, James, and Parker, and well, you're watching Trying This Out before. Hope you like, comment, and subscribe, and uh, that'll be it.